Pulaski could soon be getting its water from Lake Michigan. I'm your Pulaski neighborhood reporter Perry Apostolakos here with the village's plans for a pipeline and why the village of Howard is getting involved. The village of Pulaski relies solely on well water, but village president Keith Chambers says they now need a bigger source. A number of years ago we found that our water supply wasn't adequate for a major event. Like, he says, a major fire. Chambers says they've looked at two options, connecting through Hobart, fed by the Green Bay Water Utility, or through Howard, supplied by the Brown County Water Authority. Chambers says an outside accounting firm told them the Hobart route would be cheaper. That was the, uh, that was the better option for the village of Pulaski. But the village of Howard disagrees, saying the estimate is not accurate. We are closer to Pulaski, therefore the pipeline length is shorter and is naturally less expensive because we can deliver water um, in excess of uh, what Pulaski is requesting. Um, and it, that just simply wasn't reflected in the original cost estimates. Now a hearing will be held before the State Public Service Commission where Howard will share why they're opposed. But another community agrees with Pulaski's plan. I spoke on the phone with the town of Pittsfield chairperson, Keith Denise. He says Pittsfield once asked Howard to supply water to a development, but backed out when Howard started talking about annexation. And we told him, yeah, that is possible, but I know if we're gonna run a pipeline up into Pittsfield, there's gonna be some conditions on how Howard could possibly grow into parts of the town in the future. Howard Village Administrator Paul Everett says the annexation plan would take two or three decades. Denise says the, quote, aggressive nature of Howard's plans made Pittsfield more willing to hook up to Pulaski's water pipeline. In Pulaski, no matter how the pipeline is constructed, water bills will go up. Chambers can't say by how much at this point. The, the infrastructure alone to get it here is going to is going to make the, the price go up. If they get permission from the state, the village hopes to start construction of the pipeline this fall and finish in about a year. Officials from Pulaski and Howard will meet with the State Public Service Commission in July. In Pulaski, Perry Apostolakos, NBC 26.